Hello world, in this video, I am going to show you how to register a discord slash command. Discord is a popular chat platform and they have recently implemented the function for slash commands. Now if you have used a slack or metamost, you might be aware of slash commands. So slash commands allow you to interact with applications without the need to create a bot. So discord has some in build slash commands that you can use and then we can pass in a query hello world and then you see that we got some options over here so this was a small built-in example of a slash command moreover you can build your own slash commands so let's get started the first thing we need is to create a discord application so open up the discord developer portal by navigating to discord.com slash developer slash applications now we will create a new app called wiseman link Now since a friend on Twitter with the handler Hey Wiseman suggested this idea, I created an application with that name. Now you need either your OAuth2 token or a bot token to register your slash command. We will use the bot token for our slash command and to now to get the bot token we need to first create a bot in our application. And now copy the bot token, we will need this later on. We also need to give our application two scopes. The first is the applications.command scope which is really important when you are building a slash command. And next would be the bot scope. Now the bot scope is not necessary when you are building a slash command. But since we will use the bot token for authentication, I am giving it the bot scope as well. I am just gonna go ahead and add this to my test server. And the wise man link is added. Congratulations, you created your first discord bot. The bot does nothing at this point, which is fine. We will now register a slash command. I have created an npm package which makes it easy to register a slash command without any options. So I'm going to use that. However, you can do the same via call postman or any other tool. Now in discord, you can have your slash command either in a guild or globally. So I am gonna use the guild command over here. I will name this bot link, add link notion. And now this is where we need the bot token. Now I can again go back to the developer portal and get my bot token we also need an application id and lastly we need a guild id to get the guild id you can right click on the server and click on copy id awesome so our slash command was successfully registered now let's take a look at it on Discord. So now if I do slash link, which is sending, but we are gonna get an error because we haven't told Discord how to handle this, which we will gonna take a look at in the next video. 